This evening I'm out here at the Wichita River at Lucy Park and I'm here to finally release this uh, little male red-eared slider. It was brought to me earlier in the summer and he'd been hit by a car and uh, fractured his uh, uh, you can see fractured uh, his carapace right there and the uh, the crack went up the carapace this way and down here on the bridge it, it fractured it right in there and that all is since healed really nicely and the last uh, two or three weeks he's been in the waterland tub with the other uh, red-eared sliders and painted turtles the ones that are more his size but before that for uh, two or three months he had to be dry docked and he pretty much essentially lived in my bathroom and just walked around on the floor in there and every now and then him and the other turtles that were in dry dock uh, got a bath in, in the bathtub but they had to be in shallow water and only for short periods of time so that their wounds weren't contaminated and then after he healed up after he got some scar tissue in there um, like I, I do with all the other uh, turtle rehab cases then I move them out to the outdoor enclosure for exercise and so it's getting on uh, very near fall now we're in the mid-September starting to really cool off it's uh, in the lower 80s 70s uh, sometimes during the day it's a really good day to go ahead and release him he's uh, at a nice healthy weight may as well start releasing everybody that uh, can go uh, right now so they have a little bit of time to uh, get acclimated or reacclimated and uh, prepare for uh, winter so uh, September this is a pretty good time to start getting my releases out of the way for who can go and this fella is one of them I just need to get him safely down here to the water's edge. The river level is disappointingly uh, uh, back down a little bit, a little bit low. Um, since all the uh, the flood waters, the uh, rain that we got months ago, um, it's down many, many feet now again. But. Uh, we're supposed to have a pretty wet um, winter this year, so hopefully we'll get some more precipitation in here and raise the water level so that they'll be protected from the uh, very cold temperatures. There we go, boy. Back home. This is about as close as I could figure to... Uh, uh, best guess of habitat where he he came from. Look at there he is, hey baby. He came back up to say hi. Most of them do that. They they don't swim off immediately. Current's pretty strong there though. He was found actually up on Seymour Highway, Fifth Street, um, up you know several blocks up on a very busy road. He had been hit. He was found near an intersection there. Got lucky. The damage wasn't that great. And so that's uh, three or four blocks up from here. So down here at Wichita River, this is about the best uh, guess.